We have a star on the red couch right now. A second competition entered the barbecue world here in Memphis earlier this year. Now, teams from around the globe descended on Tom Lee Park to compete at Smoke Slam for the largest purse in pork barbecue contest history. And they'll be back along the mighty Mississippi in May. And Smoke Slam organizers have tapped a barbecue hall of famer as their official spokesperson, world champion, author, restaurateur, and more. The Mid-South is no stranger to our guest here on the couch, Pitmaster Melissa Cookston. Hi. Hello. Oh, wow. So, I mean, they had to bring the star out, you know, highest purse, and then they had to bring you out. So tell me how that feels to, to be part of this. You know, I am so excited. I was born and raised on the Mississippi down in the Delta, and there's nothing like cooking barbecue on the banks of the mighty Mississippi. So what does your role as Smoke Slam All-Star mean? I have no idea. <laughs> I See, am, I, this is why people watch you. This is why, <laughs> you know, you got the Netflix deal. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I, I really believe in bringing the public into barbecue competitions and Smoke Slam is doing that. I mean, they will have live fire, live music, VIP experiences, a market bazaar, uh, you know, a Ferris wheel and games for kids really involving the public in this in this barbecue competition. So you actually get to walk around, watch the competitors and eat barbecue. OK, let's talk about that part, because that's one of the first things you said when you sat down. You said the public will actually get to eat it because usually they just walk around smelling it. I mean, and you know how barbecue smells. Yes, it makes you so hungry. Yes. So, you know, in barbecue competitions, the public is not really involved and Smoke Slam is really putting everything out there to get the public what they want and need. Okay, tell us about your nonprofit World Junior Barbecue League that's also coming back. Let me tell you, this I retired from competition barbecue because I enjoyed cooking with these kids so much. Wow. We are now going around the world. We have international teams. And get this, $25,000 purse for the kids. So I'm, I love cooking with these kids. You They're put so a spotlight smart. on them. You I know, love it. that is great. And, and you've had an impact as well. I try, oh. you know, I, I have a saying, if I can impact one kid a year mm -hmm. by giving them life skills, cooking barbecue, right. I've done something. What is the thing you like to tell, you know, somebody who is like, I want to be the next Melissa Cookston? It's easy. <laughs> it is so is easy. It? Yes, yes. You know, it, Barbecue can be intimidating to cook, but um, it's really easy. It just takes a little bit of practice, but but anybody can do it. So it's just that encouragement to know, I, you know, I can get out there and do it. And so why did you want to team up? Because, I mean, you have a lot going on. You have a lot going on. Yeah. So, I mean, why this? I believe in what Smoke Slam is doing, um, mm -hmm. you know, bringing the public in, along with a $250,000 purse, which is the largest purse in barbecue history. Come on, I mean, who doesn't want to be involved with that? Right, and so um, how, you know, they're topping year two, right, with, um, you know, letting the people eat it, um, having you there. Um, what do you think really stands out this time around? Well, um, you know, I think that we'll have even more teams. Okay, yeah. Uh, which, which is exciting. I think that we'll have some new teams that, um, you know, are excited about cooking down on the river. And all the VIP experiences that you get to go behind the scenes and eat the barbecue, yeah. as well as live fire. I mean, cooking with live fire is not what we traditionally think of barbecue. Okay, so. But uh -huh. you get to see it. Yeah. Roasting on a spit, whole hogs on a Ferris wheel, you know, and you get to sample that. So I do want to ask about you. Um, okay, so how's everything going outside of the smoke, smoke slam? What's going on for 2025? I am really excited about this year. Uh, you know, my daughter's working with me. And we um, we have a lot of international travel. I've got a new cookbook I'm working on. Oh my goodness! What is the theme? Can uh, you say it, or it's a secret? No, you I don't have a whole lot of red. secrets. Yeah, what just it, don't tell anybody. Just don't tell, don't tell anybody. Um, <laughs> you know, I, I'm going to put some international flavors in there. We'll always have barbecue classics yeah. because that's what I do. But in our travels, we found that there are other ways of cooking with fire 
that are fantastic. Wow, and so what is it like uh, working with your family? And you know, I was, we were talking right before, um, you know, the camera came on and you were saying that as you know, your daughter and your husband are chefs, so you don't even, you know. They cook for me. All right there, but how does it feel to work, you know, with family? It's pretty special. Uh, you know, people think, oh my gosh, there's no way I could work with my spouse or, or my, my child, um, you know, seven days a week, 365 days a year. But we have a special bond because of barbecue. Yeah. I mean, when we were competing, we were on the road together. Yeah. A lot of togetherness, but it, it's, it's, it's so special. Okay, we're gonna be looking for that book, Melissa Cookston, Barbecue Supreme. So excited that you're coming to the Smoke Slam this year. And this is our information. If you're not already following, give that a follow. Melissa.Cookston on Instagram and Melissa Cookston Cooks on Facebook. Of course, check out the website because that has all the information. And then the Smoke Slam is happening um, May 15th and 17th and everyone's gonna be looking out for you. That, that um, those are the, um, web mail websites and email all the information you need. All right. Thank you so much for coming. Thanks and for having me. We'll be right back.